What's up guys, Joel Valley from Media Glitch here, and I am here with, damn, the scariest baby child <laughs> in film history, Miko Hughes. How are you today? Thank you, man. I'm good. Yeah, good to be here. Well, thank you so much for coming out to Comic-Con. We really appreciate that. Now, if you guys do not know, he plays Gage yeah. from Pet Cemetery. Is that correct? Absolutely. Yeah, a long time ago. Among other things. Now, okay, so I usually start with breaking in stories, but you're breaking in as you're so young. What do you remember? What are the first things remembering about being on a set Hollywood? Are you, when does it click? Yeah, it was interesting growing up because Pet Cemetery. I was so young. I didn't know I was acting. I was just a kid. I grew up in it. I didn't realize how lucky I was to have these opportunities until I was probably close to 10, if I had to guess. Um, so it was, yeah, a unique situation, I suppose. Do you remember anything about being on set uh, the Pet Cemetery? I want to say yes. I mean, I, I think so. They're like picture memories, like memories of memories. But again, I was so young that I, I wonder how much of it is just hearing the stories my parents told over the years and seeing the pictures and like seeing the film throughout the years that if it is there, it's just been like solidified more than, you know, I don't remember anything else about being that age. So maybe a little bit. Right, yeah. right. Yeah. Now, can you still do that crazy face? You know when you're walking up to, is it Judd? Is that, yeah. no, and, and you're walking up to him and you're about to slice him? You know that, that evil face, can you still do that? I don't know, I, I, look, I look pretty different. I guess. So. Can you teach me? I'll do it with you. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Like a, yeah. All right, oh yeah. Am I doing it good? I don't know, I need, we need a mirror. Am Let's I doing? Practice. <laughs> <laughs> so later you would go on to do Full House, right? Yeah, yeah. What do you remember about those days being on set, Full House? Was it crazy? What's going on over there? Yeah, it was fun. It was cool. We got to, to work with the Olsen twins, and uh, I think I did like 13 episodes over the years. They just kept bringing me back every so often. And it was fun. I was a brat. Everybody wanted to punch my character, but... <laughs> Could you could you call the Olsen twins up today? And be like, hey man, it's Aaron, man. Can you you want to hang out? I don't think so. No, I mean they might remember me, but uh, like I, super young as well, right? Yeah, I wouldn't be surprised if they didn't. I wouldn't be offended, but uh, they might know my character from the show. I don't know. Yeah, if the the opportunity presented itself, it'd be interesting to see, I suppose. Now, um, being in horror movies. You were in uh, New Nightmare as well yeah. with uh, Robert England, Nightmare on Elm Street. Uh, do you remember those days? Absolutely, yeah. Uh, New Nightmare was probably my favorite uh, project to work on because okay. it was I was a huge Freddy fan. It was weird how Freddy was like this pop culture icon. I never, uh, you know, before the filming, I hadn't seen any of the Nightmare movies, but I knew pretty well who, yeah. who Freddy was. So... That was really exciting, finding out that it was gonna get to work work on that. Um, and then like the hell set and just the whole production was, it was great. Like being seven and running around, like running from Freddy, it was a blast. And Wes Craven is back in the director's chair on that one. Yeah. Um, the late Wes Craven, yeah. amazing director, writer. Do you remember anything did uh, about him, seeing anything he did that you were like, wow, that's amazing? It, it was an honor to get to work with him. I think he was for sure my, my favorite director that, uh, that I got to work with. And uh, he was just really smart, really kind of soft-spoken, but when he had something to say, you, you heard it, you know? Um, yeah, yeah, it was, he was great. He's missed, for sure. On a regular, do you watch horror movies at all? Or? Oh, yeah, yeah, I love horror. What's your favorite one? Yeah, uh, you know what I'm watching right now is Ash vs. Evil Dead. I got into it a little late. I'm, I'm catching up right now, but I love the originals. I got all the original DVDs and like special editions, and so I'm pretty stoked on that. I don't know what took me so long to start it because it's it's like dead on for the original. So oh, yeah. it's so fun, the tone of it. So. And I think Rami even directed the first episode, and then oh, that's fantastic! I didn't catch yeah. that. That's awesome. Yeah. That's super cool. I thought you were gonna say that Arachnophobia was your favorite that's a movie. Good one. Yeah, that's a good. You, you don't even know what I'm. Referencing to? Right. Uh, well, I know the movie. What do you mean? Now, okay. So there's an episode of Full House. Oh, that's <laughs> right. Oh, good dude. Deep cuts. Good job. Yeah, yeah. yeah. All that's, baby. Yeah, slick. Yeah. <laughs> what are you doing up? All 
people are watching arachnophobia. Right. Is there any um, upcoming projects, anything you're, you're working on right now you'd like to promote or bump? Uh, potentially. I'm, we'll see. I think I've, maybe in the next couple of years I don't want to say anything, you know. I'm, I'm working on some things and uh, I definitely will put it on blast if and when I feel like it's worth it. So, yeah. Awesome. yeah. Otherwise, I'm just living life. Well, man, I appreciate you taking time for us. I know you, you know, we're stopping everything that's Not going on. Thanks so, for but having, uh, thanks for you know considering me important enough to talk to. So. No, dude, uh, Pet Cemetery, like, dude, this is like, there's, there's two like crazy kids in film history, Linda Blair and yourself. Yeah. Uh, well, thank you. I'm honored to be even remotely considered in her category. So, oh, thanks, man. Dude, you're terrifying. <laughs> You're terrifying. You were terrifying as a kid. Thank you. You're even terrifying in Full House. Now that I think about it. <laughs> I was just because you were mean, dude. Yeah, you were always picking on her. I was a jerk for sure. Yeah. Yeah. So. Awesome, man. Thank you so much for your time. Appreciate it, you guys. Yeah, dude. All right. Take care. See ya. All right, man. Before I leave, you got to say the line. Are you ready? Boys have a penis. Girls have a vagina. <laughs> I'm sorry. There's a girl. There's like a little kid right. <laughs> Standing right over there. It's your fault, man. You I, I'll take full blame. I'll take full blame. <laughs> <laughs>